Hello, amazing Sagittarians. Hi, this is Robin. Robin's Realm Readings. Thank you so much for coming back. We're going to look at April, okay? And there will be an extended in your for your reading, Sagittarius, in my Patreon account. I'm, I'm uploading all of the extended on my Patreon account if you'd like to have access to them. It's actually what it is. is um, it's a complete play out and a quick rundown and a complete play out of the message so you can get right to the point. Then at the end, uh, we investigate everything that's weird. And then at the end, we'll uh, check you and um, your energy in April with every other sign. Should you invest in them? Should you hold back? Are they faithful? You know? Where, what's the status of that relationship? Sagittarius, thank you for coming into my channel. I believe if you're here, you are all here. Many of you are returning. Thank you, darlings. You know I love you. Let's see what this theme of your reading is this month. April 2023 for my beautiful Sagittarius. Calling on divine want light, the highest form of love that could possibly be. Calling upon the energies of air, fire, water, earth, ether, the Holy Spirit, from the divine living most high. We're seeking into the realms to see what's going on with Sagittarius in love and relationships in April. So appreciate it when you hit the like button. All you're doing is you're giving me more uh, power to come back and help you, right? Thank you so much for that consideration. Uh, God sees everything. All right, thank you. All right, let's go. Spirit. I'm not doing any private readings right at this moment. I'll be picking that up next week. If you're interested, and you can wait till next week, Blossoming Abundance, feel free to go um, to email me, robinsbrownreadings at gmail. We also have um, hostilities, though. Ooh, somebody is not nice. What else for my Sagittarians? The door to value. Oh, they're mad because you're bringing in the box. You've been abundant, and someone's mad about it. Oh, my God, these people. So thank you so much for your presence. Let's see what's going on for my Saggies. Show me what's going on, Spirit. Sagittarius, someone rising, Venus. Blossoming abundance. Somebody's pissed about it. First of all, I'm going to ask who this is that's pissed. What is their deal, Leo? Spirit, show me. What's the deal with this person? thinking woman it's a female she's trying to uh, she's doing something what is she doing spirit oh okay well someone's mad because you found your value in the lord he's allowing you to blossom that's what it is look you guys male or female my readings are not gender specific they are for whoever they are and their energy all right let's see who's this hostile person they're strategizing, but guess what? It's failing. It's in reverse. They're trying to strategize something. Trying to do magic on you, but it's failing. Because God sees you on your temple path. He's not going to let that happen. Got it, girls and boys? I think you are on the right path. What else is influencing this reading, please? The higher mind. Archangel Uriel is protecting you. Your crown chakra, while you walk away from nasty, negative crap, and you finally let it behind you. More, please. Go into this meditative state, meditation and prayer, healing, wholeness, oneness with the universe, oneness with God. And give me one more for my Sagittarians. Ooh, they gave me two. The door to romance. That's the deal. You're waiting for the real deal. Somebody might have opened you up or God might have opened you up to some kind of an understanding of what love really is, what your value really is, and this ain't it. Hostilities, arguing, co uh, comparing, bringing, trying to do magic on you to keep you. What? It's not working. It's not working. Archangel Gabriel is here to tell you to speak your truth. Um, tell me about one more. Yeah, this person is being shut down. Their creative force is being shut down. Their solar plexus is off. God's not going to let that happen. While he brings you into caring connections, people that really love you and really will support you. More, please. Goddess of the moon. 
That could be this person over here living in some kind of a fantasy, Cancer or Pisces. But you're getting abundant. There's cornucopia, there's abundance, there's Jesus, there's healing, there's thinking, there's speaking the truth. What's going to happen to this person over here? I think the angel's addressing them and they're telling, warning them of a storm. Or they are the storm. Yep. Wow. What should you do? Yeah, they're chasing you like a bad habit. Look at that. Trying to chase the light, but they don't want the light. They want you to be dark. That is the difference. All right, let's take a look at who this might be and how they are. I'll pull five cards for you and five cards for your this person here. Or a new person will show up. Spirit, show me what Sagittarius's energy shows up at out this time. Thank you for being here. Thank you for subscribing. If you haven't subscribed and you'd like to, please do that now. And when you do... There's an all bell. That would be the preference. This way, anything I put up, you can join with. The Lord replied, my presence will go with you and I will give you rest. Spirit, show me what's going on for Sagittarius. How's Sagittarius showing up? Okay, here we go. Wow. You're showing up as solid, grounded, dependable, hardworking, making money, being, being um, a lovable person, someone that can be trusted. What is your challenge? Getting justice from someone who tried to has tried to keep you off balance or take your money from you or take your fame from you or take your home from you or take your family from you. You have many, many choices. You need to choose very, very well on this and you will come out of this with happy, happy, happy tears when all is said and done. There's rejoicing. So in your reading, we have an awful lot of um, activity. Tell me why the 10 is in reverse, walking away. I don't care about the money. I care about you. Tell me why the Seven of Cups is here. They, did, they didn't have any choice. You made them go into meditation and prayer. Yep, and they're not able to come. For, you're not going to give your energy to this person anymore because you need to let God handle them. They're in stress. And that's where they belong. If they're going to be constantly a mess in your life, guess what happens? You're walking right into new love. Right into new love. Pure love. True love. Wow. Okay, show me this other person. Show me this person that you're dealing with predominantly at this time. There they are. Kind of a biatch. Kind of a warmonger. Kind of a troublemaker. Kind of a person that likes to compare things and bring up uh, other people's, bring up guilt trips, bring up faults, bring up, remind you of your faults, remind you of other people doing better than you, comparing, gossiping, backstabbing. What else, please? Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. <clears throat> yep. And spying like crazy. They got other people spying on you. Clarify that. High Priestess, um, they know you're a High Priestess, whoever this is. They're secretive, though. They're holding back their energy. There's not going to be any breakthrough on them. They're, they're poor and they're burdened because of what they're doing. It's their energy. It's the way they're handling their energy, Sagittarius, right? Tower is about to happen to them because they just won't stop. They just won't stop. Outcome, Six of Pentacles, finally. Somebody has to pay up. Yeah, they better get a job. This is a two of cups in reverse. It's an ex who had another lover and decided that they would put on a big show for somebody who was single and abundant. And <clears throat> they made a big, big, big mistake. They made a mistake because you it made you what, get closer to God. Now you have the energy protecting you. You are completely protected. And loving. Queen of Cups. So you're in your heart. You're doing beautiful. You're being you're being nourishing, a nourishing soul and a healer too at that. You're probably a healer. Wow. I'm gonna carry this on in a minute, but let me have two more cards. Give me an idea. What is the romance message for this Sagittarian 
soulmate. Is that the past or the present? Nope, worth waiting for. So there's a new soulmate coming. What about this person? <clears throat> yeah, this person right here. They can't express their love anymore because they don't know how. They lost it. I think God just cut them off. I think so. I think God just cut them off. Yeah, they're trying to make the effort, but they can't get through because they, they're causing problems. Yeah. God's making them pull back and retreat. We'll look at this in the extended a little more. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. It's pretty interesting. I hope you are doing well. I wish you love, healing, wholeness, abundance, peace of mind, kindness, because I think you need it, a lot of it. Sagittarians, you guys are wonderful. Um, so I don't know what all this actually means. Let me just say the prayer of protection. The light of God surrounds us. The love of God enfolds us. The power of God protects us. And the presence of God watches over us. Where you are, God is. Look at that. You're supposed to be in joy. Worth waiting for with the soulmate. What about this one? They're... Uh, they feel like they're bigger than God, but now they're being humbled. Yeah, they didn't believe, but you did. They didn't believe, but you did, and you're never, ever, ever, ever alone. You're releasing all of that nonsense. Yes, you really are. Good for you. Well, the rest of this reading can be found on patreon.com. Don't forget to go to my bath store if you need a spiritual bath products. I have three different types. If you've never seen them, they're amazing. They're a Reiki blast uh, so that Reiki and empowered so that when you use them, it's, it really, really accentuates what your intentions are in your healing mantras. So we have attract love and abundance. I have a large bag. A large bag, several baths, and I have a small one. This is a beautiful smell. It's beautiful. You will love, love, love it. Um, it's elegant, and it's everything comes with a crystal, and then you can buy the set separately with the Attract Love Spray. Those are usually uh, 15 a piece. We also have clear negative energy if you need that really bad. That comes with crystals and... Knocking out that negative energy, right? Do one step more of protection for yourself, right? Michael the Archangel Invocation will knock, will wipe out that negativity around you, in you, around you, and, and um, in relative to your space and your business. Then you sanctify everything with sacred Holy Spirit. This is what you use before you go into prayer, meditation, or some kind of hands-on therapy. I thank you for your presence. I thank you for liking, subscribing, sharing, and supporting my work anyone who's blessed blessed me with a gift with with cards with um even requesting readings i appreciate that very much i respect you and <clears throat> just know that i'm on the same page if you're walking with jesus well i'm right there with you okay but don't forget to go and get your triple threat spray set this will knock it all out and you get crystals with it and mantras and you will love this very much my friends, everything's in the box below. Much love to you and namaste.